what I have for you guys today is this Shopify website that I kind of created for the purpose of this video. We are basically selling uh, some sneakers right here. So I have that products right here. And the solution I'm going to be offering today is a way for you to accept M-Pesa payments uh, directly on your Shopify uh, website. And not only M-Pesa payments, but card payments as well. So stick with me as we get started uh, in this particular demo. So first of all, let's go ahead and check out the single product page. So if I go ahead and click on this particular product, I'll be redirected to this particular page where I'll be able to see the product and uh, I, uh, a description about it. I can be able to increase this quantity and reduce it however I like. So let me just uh, keep it at one. Then I can just go ahead and click uh, add to cart. So this has been added to cart, so I can now go ahead and uh, check out. So one of the things I also love about Shopify is the checkout experience. I think they have really uh, made it so fast and very modern and like uh, WordPress. So yeah, the credit where credit is due. So right here, let me just uh, input these particular details and then click on continue to shipping. So standard shipping and then just click on continue to payment. So as you can see, uh, all, pay, all transactions are secure and encrypted. And uh, now you'll be able to pay with card and M-Pesa. So pay now. So once you click on the pay button, you will be redirected to this secure checkout link where you will be able to complete your transaction. So let us go ahead and uh, complete this particular transaction. So I go ahead and click on pay now. I get this model where I'll be able to choose whether I want to make payment with M-Pesa or whether I want to do this with a card. So first of all, let's do the M-Pesa for testing. Okay. Then uh, let's go to initiate that. So I'm going to get an SDK push. Mm -hmm. So I completed that particular transaction. So let's just wait for it. And since this one has been completed, I'll be redirected to the success page. Yeah, there's the message. So the order is being processed and voila. Thank you for your order. Thank you for watching. your order is confirmed. And of course, I have definitely received an email confirm that this order was actually uh, successful. So if I go ahead and open that up, I should find an email, probably uh, the promotions tab. So as you can see, thank you for your purchase. We're getting your order ready to be shipped. We'll notify uh, when it has been sent. So you can go ahead and view the order or visit the store right from your particular email. So yeah that order was uh, successful. So let's just go ahead and test out the card feature as well. So for that, I have to get the cards. Yeah, so let's just go ahead and click on continue shopping. So I'm back on the Slick website, very minimalistic, very clean. Then uh, we're going to use the same product and then I'm just going to add this to the cart. And of course, I'm going to check out. Put in that contact information. And then I'm going to click continue to shipping. Continue to payment. And pay now. So of course, all these payments are being processed by Intercent. And if you didn't know what Intercent is, Intercent is a fantastic service that allows you to be able to receive uh, payments from multiple providers. You can receive from M-Pesa, uh, from card payments. You can even receive from Bitcoin and Cash App. So that's 
a fantastic service. And this is not even a paid ad. So just go ahead, be sure I leave the link to their fantastic service down in the description so you guys can check it out. So um, let's test out the card. So, nah. So continue to payment. Pay now. So I'm going to click on pay now. Then I'm going to click on pay with card. So of course, you know, you know the drill, I'm going to blur this out. Okay, so it will start card processing. So card authorization. So I'm going to receive an OTP via SMS or via email from my, my bank. So yeah, I'm going to choose email and submit. So an OTP has been sent. We we'll go back into this particular primary and uh, refresh. I'll we'll see if there's an OTP right there. Yeah. Just going to copy it, get back, submit. So the status is now processing and it should be complete in just a few seconds. So yeah, clearly it is now successful. Okay, so yeah, thank you. So let's just go ahead and check out from uh, the admin side uh, what information we have. So if I go ahead and go into orders, I can be able to see the orders that I've received and their payment status. So as you can see, uh, let's even check out the latest uh, transaction, latest order, I'm sorry. So as you can see, uh, it's unfulfilled because we haven't actually gotten to delivering the product. But once you do, you can just click on fulfill item. But as you can see, it was paid and it was paid by customer. You can be able to see uh, this was the payment ID. Okay. And uh, the card, the card was uh, it was paid by a by a card. This is the details. All of this information is already available here. So yeah, you can even go ahead and initiate a refund if that is is necessary. Maybe you are out of stock for a particular products and what's not. So yeah, all this information will be available to you. So yeah, if you wish to have this particular integration uh, done to your Shopify website then do let me know. I will leave the number down in the description as well as being displayed right now on this video. But in the future, I'm also going to be working on another video to show you exactly how you can set this up uh, yourselves. But if this is a solution that you've been looking for, then just go ahead and contact me down below. I'm pretty sure we'll have a very amicable agreement. Yeah. So yeah, this was it for this short particular demo. Hopefully you found value from this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.